Hello and welcome back to another episode of Power Rangers Lore. We have a massive update with what is going to happen in the future for Power Rangers. And all my questions I kind of asked the last issue have been answered. And I can't wait to tell you more right after this. In the newest issue of Power Rangers, the epilogue to essentially the War of Altaria, it finishes up a nice little cool questions we had lingering. What was going to happen with Zordon and Zed? What are the Omega Rangers going to be doing? Will they have a mentor? What's going to happen with Draken? And what else is going to be happening in the future for Zordon? Well, it's immediately started out with explaining a lot of different things. Well, we see the, through the cracked visor of Lord Zed that he actually still has eyes and it's not just evil glowing red eye, glowing red beams apparently. No, he actually has eyes still there and they still function. And he doesn't need that mask. He just wears it because he thinks it's cool. Well, he and Zordon have kind of a heart to heart. They have a uh, cross-examination of each other and Zordon helps, no, sorry, Lord Zed helps Zordon out of the situation they're at on the moon gives him to Alpha 5 and says, heal him, don't come back, or I'll destroy you. Th that's that's pretty impressive. Lord Zed's here, and he's still doing stuff. And the Rangers are left with his minions, Goldar, Finster, Babu, Squat, all of them. And they are given two choices. Hey, you can go back to with us, or you can go back to the moon. Whatever you want to do, if you go back with us, we'll basically call it even. You, don't, you, you worked on our side. You called. You did a good job. We'll forgive you of all past transgressions, and you can just go wherever you want after that, or you can go back to serving Lord Zed. Well, they choose to go back to Lord Zed, and he basically reveals that he put some device in the power chamber, and they're leaving. They're just leaving. We don't know where they're going, but they've done something, some, in some fashion to set it out. And I think what that device was. Call me out right now if I'm wrong, but. I think the device is a beacon to the Machine Empire to arrive, and Zed's going to watch it all to see if they can beat him, or maybe have the Rangers take out another enemy for him to deal with in the future. I don't know, it's a smart tactic, especially for this one known as Lord Zed in this comic book. Now, what else will you find out? We find out that Zordon can't keep his Iron Man suit, or Iron, Iron Man slash Mr. Freeze suit. It's killing him slowly because of the cracks in the device that was caused by Zardis in the battle and he can't keep it anymore so he basically takes one final look around sees the earth as he wants to see it and then immediately has to give up and be put into a new tube he has to work with grace in order to do this and so they both just suck up their pride in order to continue on functioning as basically a defensive earth type of thing now i i like that whole thing i thought it was perfect and just sort of going <sighs> Just when I get free, I have to go back. And he kind of like go, he kind of gives it's bittersweet ending for that. The Omega Rangers basically figure out that, well, they don't have a mentor. Blue, Blue Emissary has no answers for them. He goes, I don't know what's going on. I gotta go find the Morphing Masters themselves because the other emissaries didn't appear. I'm the only one who showed up. What's going on? So he leaves. They're left going, what are we gonna do now? And I think they're gonna go chase after Draken. Now, Draken did contact them, but only Trini. Basically telling him what his whole plan was, blah 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 blah. She offers him to come back. We're like, we'll forgive you for everything that you've done because you helped us in the last battle. And he goes, what am I, an idiot? No, I don't think so. And they kind of have like a little heart to heart, and you know, suggest that there might be some type of kindling of love there. Now, don't out of my mind, like it, it is still Tommy Oliver underneath there. But remember, it's also Draken, the most evil version of Tommy to ever exist. So, I don't know. Think about that. I kind of like it. I, I like that mentality because Trini's like, no nonsense. I know what you're doing. I'm the smart one here. Don't mess with me. But, you know, she's also going, maybe you're not as bad as you seem. I don't know. I like it. They're going to be chasing after him and maybe some more. That's all we kind of got from that point on. Now, that is what happens in this comic book so far. We get a lot of explanations what's going to happen for the future. But we don't also. We still don't know what Lord Zed's plan is. Now, my suggestion is something the Machine Empire. The Zeo Crystal hasn't given them new powers yet, so I was wrong about that. But it could still be in the next few issues. We don't know. Whew. And will the Omega Rangers ever get a fifth Ranger? 
I don't know. It's only time will tell. I hope so. Fingers crossed. Now, we do know in the future that they will meet Andros or somebody that looks very similar to Andros in the future. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think for the speculation of the rest of the comic book series. we got a lot more to go around and talk about. Thank you, guys. Have a good one, and may the power protect you always. Now, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Everything you guys do, every comment, every like, every subscription helps me grow as a channel. And I need your comments. I need to learn how what I need to do better because me just doing the same old, same old is nice. It's easy for me, but, you know, it gets boring. I need to know what you guys' opinions are. So don't be afraid to put down below if you like it, if you don't like it, why you don't like it. If you don't like it, if you like it, tell me why. Let me do, see if we can do more for you. I will be doing some more videos for you guys soon. Do not worry. I've got sick back and forth, so it kept throwing me off my entire work schedule. I'm going to go back to the gym, but don't worry. I'll be back to the normal schedule here in the future. Thank you, guys. Have a good one.